Hi, I'm Eric Holsinger. I want to help out other iPhone developers who might be having problems with the Xcode code sign failed with Xcode 1 error. Uh, if you already know that it's ambiguous matches, the problem is that you have two certificates, one of them is expired, one of them is not, and you need to figure out which one's which. If you don't know what the problem is, uh, you can find this problem really easily by going to build, build results, clicking on the error message about the Xcode 1. Uh, there's a little expanded paragraph symbol, click on that, and you'll get a result that looks something like uh, iPhone developer, it'll be uh, your name and your hash code, and then it'll have something like ambiguous, and then it'll put in parentheses the two that match, and then it'll have your name and your hash code uh, under libraries in the system keychain, and there'll be another one listed again that's under your user username in your login keychain. So the two of them uh, have, one of them is expired, the two of them are conflicting, uh, Xcode doesn't know which one of them to use and is asking you for help. So if you know enough to go into your keychain access under utilities in application, so application utilities, keychain access, go in there, view your certificates, uh, you might be struggling with the problem of not knowing how to solve it because everything looks fine in there. The real problem is that your expired certificate is being hidden. So what you need to do is you need to go into um, uh, show expired certificates, which is the choose view show expired certificates option. And then you'll see it, it'll have a red circle with an X. That's the expired certificate. Choose that one, delete it, get out of your keychain access program, uh, go back and rebuild your program, your application, uh, everything should be fine. Hope this saves you some time. Uh, I have more detailed information in my blog entry. Um, click the link below. And uh, see you next time. Bye.